Hello there, Kyle Katarn here, and it is very early in the morning right now. Uh, that's because Star Wars Celebration Europe is going on, and they just dropped the Ahsoka trailer. The Ahsoka trailer! Everyone has been waiting for this goddamn trailer, myself included, and I'm so happy that it's finally here. Definitely worth getting my ass out of bed. I will say that the reason I'm excited for this show the most, I think, is because of how many elements of Star Wars Rebels are being tied into it and brought to live action. Um, I would love to get an animated Star Wars Rebels sequel, but in lieu of that, this show will do. Actually, as a fun fact, um, Star Wars Rebels is where this channel started. I reacted to the episode Twin Suns, and that's where this whole reaction thing began for me. So, it's kind of a full circle moment in a way, finally getting to watch this trailer. I'm so excited. I don't have anything else to say. Let's just do it! Something's coming. What is this place? Something dark. No, oh, it's her move! It's her move from Siege of Mandalore. Sense it. The Leku look better. The Leku look much better, too. This is a new beginning. Lothcat! Sabine! For some. Oh, those are Morgan Elsbeth's HKs. Oh, oh my god, Chopper! Okay, new Sith, or new Darksiders at least. Oh my god, that's the shot! That's the shot from Rebels! I can't handle this, you guys. Things have changed. I started hearing whispers. About Thrawn's return. Just in the trailer? As heir to the Empire. Heir to the Empire! Morgan Elsbeth knew it. Bro, who is that? He looks like a medieval knight. The Jedi fell a long time ago. Oh my god, I need to know everything about Evil Santa right now. That's Barris. I have no basis for that, but I bet that's Barris. Perhaps it is time to begin again. Hu Yang? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> what? August. That's really not far from now. <laughs> I just Oh, I need a minute. That was oh my god. <laughs> it and like the fact that I that I was completely unconscious not 30 minutes ago really adds to just like how emotionally this trailer just hit me. I, uh, I need to watch this again while I while I compile my thoughts. Let's do this. Something's Never thought I'd see the day. This is amazing. Something dark. Okay, so something's coming. She does a little spin move. Okay. I sense it. Those glyphs on the wall make me think world between worlds. You know. This is a new beginning. God, she looks amazing. For some. Interesting. She had short hair in the epilogue of Rebels, so some time has passed since then as well. For others. Who are these new these new bad guys? It's been a while. Things have changed. I started hearing whispers. Whispers from Mon Mothma? About Thrawn's return. How does she know? I hope it's Lars. I really hope it's Lars. Yeah, this dude. This dude right here. First of all, I love his look. It's it's dope. I love that he's got a tiny little cross guard on the bottom of the saber, too. It really gives it that medieval feel. Yeah, no, this is epic. And also... Prepare for the worst. It kind of looks like they're in the world between worlds in that moment. Look at all the, the glyphs everywhere. The Jedi fell a long time ago. There aren't many left. God damn. Perhaps it is time to begin again. I'm not sure if that is Hu Yang. It doesn't really sound like David Tennant. It could be another droid of his model. I can't wait. This 
They gave us everything. Everything! The only thing we don't have in this trailer is Ezra Bridger and a face shot of Thrawn. But you know what? I could do without the face shot. Let that happen naturally. You know, let them let them reveal it in the show. But at the same time, um, Ezra, I really need to know what's up with Ezra. Where is he? How did he get back? What's going on with the space whales? Zeb was also not on the trailer. I noticed that too. Um, but we've already seen Zeb in Mandalorian. So like, at this, at this point, we know he's going to be there, right? He has to be. This is absolutely fascinating. Um, this was a really effective trailer in that it's really given us just enough story elements to really get the speculation machine going. Really get the hype engine moving. Um, but I, I really can't wait to see what happens next. Where the show actually takes us. How it fits in with, like, The Mandalorian, for example. Because we, I'm, I'm sure that there's going to be some sort of a concerted effort among all these shows that share a timeline. To borrow from each other narratively. So I'm sure we're going to see a little bit of that. Yeah, I really can't wait. I will be following the production of this show, reacting to every episode with the Bendu right here on the channel, so you can stay tuned for that too. Um, and I'm probably going to be dropping a couple videos doing a deep analysis and breakdown of this trailer a little later, but I really wanted to get my just initial reaction and an absolute hype out to you guys as soon as possible. So I hope you enjoyed my reaction to the Ahsoka trailer. This is awesome. Check out the rest of the channel for more content reactions and reviews. Leave me a comment or a question. Let me know what you think about this. Are you hyped for this? Are you not hyped for this? What's the deal there? Um, I'd love to hear from you guys. Like I said, I'll be reacting to every episode of Ahsoka right here on the channel. And if you want to support the channel over on Patreon, uh, you'll get access to the full-length, uncut versions of those reactions, along with Mandalorian and pretty much anything else that I've ever reacted to. Um, you'll find a link in the description of the video to the Patreon page. Thanks again, and as always, may the Force be with you.